Hi, today I'm going to read for you The Library Gingerbread Man by Dottie Enderly, illustrated by Colleen M. Madden. So this is a version that I hadn't heard before. I've heard the gingerbread baby, the gingerbread girl, the gingerbread man, but this one, the library gingerbread man was new to me. So I hope it's new for a few of you. At the library, every book character has an address. The gingerbread man lives at number 398 Point two. So that's his spot on the shelf. But one day when the librarian was placing him back on the shelf, the gingerbread man leapt out of the book and whoosh, he dashed away. Stop, stop, gingerbread man, the librarian cried. You belong here. But the gingerbread man just looked back and laughed. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he went along the library shelves. As he passed a thesaurus at 423.1, someone shouted, Stop, gingerbread man, stop, cease, halt, freeze, stay. But the gingerbread man didn't stop, cease, halt, freeze, or stay. He raced on by. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. I ran away from the librarian and I can run away from you too. The gingerbread man sailed on. At 599.638, a giraffe poked his head out of a book. Stop, stop, gingerbread man. You're in the wrong section. The gingerbread man darted under the giraffe's long neck saying, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. I ran away from the librarian and a word wizard and I can run away from you too. And off he went. When he came to 629.892, a cranking, grinding robot droned, stop, stop, you are misplaced. The gingerbread man just whizzed on by. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. I ran away from the librarian and a word wizard and a giraffe, and I can run away from you too. And he kept going. When he passed 736.982, an origami bird swooped down on him. It flapped its paper wings and called, Stop! Stop, gingerbread man! You don't belong here! But the gingerbread man didn't stop. Run, run, as fast as you can! You can't catch me! I'm the gingerbread man! I ran away from the librarian, a word wizard, a giraffe, and a robot, and I can run away from you too! As he rushed by 818.602, he heard, Knock, knock. Who's there? The gingerbread man asked. The joke's on! The gingerbread man couldn't resist. The joke's on who? The joke's on you. Now stop. But the gingerbread man wasn't joking around. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. I ran away from the librarian, a word wizard, a giraffe, a robot, and a paper bird, and I can run away from you too. He's on quite an adventure. The gingerbread man ran into a crowd at 920. The biography section, Abraham Lincoln, Harriet Tubman, and Amelia Earhart tried to stop him. Stop, stop, gingerbread man, you're a long way from home. At 
The gingerbread man sped around them. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. I ran away from the librarian, a word wizard, a giraffe, a robot, a paper bird, and a jokester. And I can run away from you too. Even Jesse Owens, a record-breaking Olympic runner, couldn't keep. I'm wondering what you think is going to happen next. Let's see if you're right. The, ginger ma the gingerbread man soon came to the end of the shelves. He looked back to see the crowd closing in on him. That means they're getting close, right? They had been joined by a space alien from 001.942. A philosopher from 180 and a cyclops from 990, excuse me, 292.1. The gingerbread man looked down at the floor, far, far below. If he jumped, he might break an arm or a leg or crack into crumbly pieces. Just then, a fluffy white arctic fox came slinking out of a book at 998. Looks like you're trapped, Fox said. I need, uh, uh, I need to get to the ground, the gingerbread man told him. Fox inched closer. I'm quick and light on my feet. Get up on my back and we'll jump together. Should he trust him? The gingerbread man wasn't sure he could trust the fox, but time was running out. He climbed onto Fox's back. Wait, said Fox. You should be even higher. Climb onto my head instead. The gingerbread man didn't like being that close to Fox's mouth, but he didn't have time to argue. With a mighty leap, Fox sprang off the shelf, threw back his head, and sent the gingerbread man sailing high into the air. As the gingerbread man came down, he saw the fox waiting with his mouth open wide. The gingerbread man dropped closer and closer and closer and closer. Snap! The clever librarian closed him back into his book. It is particularly hard to outsmart a librarian. There you go, she said, placing him back in his own spot at 398.2. And there he stayed, waiting to be checked out by the eager readers in the library. I hope you enjoyed that adventure as much as I did reading it. And I hope that you'll talk to somebody, tell them who the characters are in this story. The library gingerbread man. What happened first? And then what happened? And after that? And next? And then finally, or last, what happened at the end? So tell me, where did the story take place? What's the setting? And after that, what was the problem? And how was it solved? Until next time.